I forgot to record last night just because we came in so late. Literally, we landed at like three o'clock and then we had to get our bags. And then one of our cousins came and picked us up from the airport and then drive from the airport to the place. Took a while. So we literally didn't go to bed till like 4 a.m., 4.30. And so we were all just tired and just done with that night. But now waking up here and like looking outside in daylight, I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm in Costa Rica, which is so exciting. Today, we're gonna be surprising our cousin Maripas. She has no idea that we are here. Anything you wanna say about today? Well, I survived the first drive at the rental car. And uh, this white knuckle phone here for directions, hills, fighting motorcycles, and stuff. Lots of fun, we'll film some for you. Right now we are staying in San Jose with one of my dad's cousins and then uh, later throughout the week we will be going to Cartago and spending the rest of our week there with the other side of our family. I'll show you some of the greenery and outside here. You can barely see like a mountain back there but I will record more when we go out to the streets and my dad's driving. Look at that doggy. Guess which one is our rental car? Last time we were here, our rental car looked like this. It is on. Oh my god! <laughs> you, I. What's your license plate? So, rental cars don't have license plates, I guess. He told us it was the first one. That's why I'm surprised. This is how the rental car looks. Very nice. These are the most common cars here. What is it called? Mitsubishi. <laughs> Costa Rica. Last thing I showed you guys was surprising our cousin Maripas, which was very successful. She was like so in shock even afterwards she was trying to process it. After that we came back to San Jose and met some more of our cousins and family here. We played some board games, have a good night, ate pizza. Our plan for today, so it's bright and early, it's like 8 30 right now. We are all going hiking together to I don't know what the place is called, but I will put the name up on top and I will record more there. The guardian? This restaurant is in the middle of a mountain, like we're literally in the mountains. This is our cousin Yvonne, cousin Claire. One guy, we have that. Oi! Saluden, saluden. Hey, ¿cómo está la comida? Bien. Okay. Leo, ¿pura vida? Ah, bueno. Oh, Kevin. Hey. <laughs> Oh. 
You have to. You also have to get close. Oh, oh, I got two. Oh. Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, he shot three, four. Three, four, at least. Hey, hey. Okay, So we were over there before and we just walked all of that around this lake. So we got some stuff from uh, the market, which we will do a haul later so <laughs> because of what we got. But now we're on our way to McDonald's here. They have their own separate ice cream stand. That's so cool. Fried chicken from McDonald's. Good flavor. Eight point five. Oh yeah, go ahead. It's a cheeseburger. What do you think? The same. The same? I got chicken nuggets, and it comes in this bag. They don't have ranch, so you have to order what's salad. called salad ranch. Yeah. Better than ours, I would say. What? You can try one. It tastes like real chicken. Mm. Not a fan of the ranch. Try it's fries. Good. She can give you a better cookie. She's gonna try the fried chicken. From one to ten. Seven. Like a six. Yeah, it's not like, I don't know, compare it to the States. Or is it more greasy and stuff like that? Wait, 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 wait you have to show them before you eat them. They're, 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 they're broken. <laughs> the other companies. So, did you get that video? Yes. Okay, Kit Kat McFlurry and then the Oreo McFlurry. Does it taste the same? Yeah, I think they have a lot more things. It's, it's not the same, but it's like. I want to try some. Well, it has good. I'm gonna try my McFlurry now. Mm -hmm. I could get McFlurry, which we do not have. Love me. Different but good. The spoon is a wood. Yeah. I know. It's like the milk in the ice cream is creamier. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got from the Central Market in San Jose today. I got this. Uh, Costa Rica Pura Vida with the toucan shirt and then Gabby got this shirt that also says Costa Rica Pura Vida very pretty all of the flowers my dad got this uh, you know little driver's license and it says a lot of the Costa Rican slang obviously the big one being my I forget how much everyone uses it here and I just love hearing it. One thing that I also noticed is that they say my like very smoothly in their sentences. You barely notice it, like you just get used to just hearing my, 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 my everywhere. Gabby got this visor hat. She now plays tennis and she doesn't have a hat, but look how cute it is. Now she can wear it. So I also like to bring back um, some things for my coworkers every single time that I go on a trip. So I got these cute pens because we all work in the office together. So this one's a sea turtle. This one is a frog. This one is a parrot. This one is a toucan. This one is a big, beautiful butterfly. 
my little sister got this for her friend, Costa Rica, Pura Vida. She also got this cute little sea turtle keychain that says Costa Rica for herself. Gabby also got this cute Costa Rica Pura Vida tote bag for my mom. She wanted something with the rooster. She loves roosters. Like everything in her kitchen is roosters. Whenever we go on a trip and we see something that's a rooster, we get it for her. So walking around the whole market, we've been asking people, hey, do you have anything with a rooster? And everyone said no. But then I finally found this. Rooster painted with the beautiful background. We are at the zoo today. What is it called? Funda Zoo? Is that how you say it? We literally just entered and here's our first animal. So now we're at the mall. This um, mall has three floors. You know how like American malls are usually circles? This is like zigzags and three floor uh, floors. And look, the food court's also on another floor. So they have a lot of options here. You also have see the pot of milk. Powdered milk. Powdered milk. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna change it up. I would, I would take this whole thing with me home. <laughs> San Pedro Mall. Hi. So it is the end of day four here in Costa Rica. We are currently in Cartago, which is my dad's dad's side of the family that lives here. So my grandpa's side that we are visiting now. We are staying in a new room here at my aunt's house. Well, my dad's aunt, so my aunt's house. Our plan for the next couple of days, we are going to take a road trip to another city. I forgot what it's called, but it's like three hours away to go see Arenal, a volcano that's very active and well known here in Costa Rica. And we're just gonna spend the night there. Today was just going to see that zoo. And after that, we went to the mall, but the mall was pretty dead and we were all tired. Like the weather here in Costa Rica, it's um, been rainy all week. And ever since we've been here, it's been raining every single day. It's okay, cause it's not like super bad or we haven't been stuck in the rain or we don't like let it ruin our plans. And it's so funny because everyone is telling us that this is not the raining season. It's supposed to be super, super sunny right now. And I don't know, we just picked the weekend that it's raining, but it's fine because like I said, we don't let it ruin our plans. We're still having so much fun seeing all of our family. So yeah, I will vlog the rest of the trip and what we do. And that is the end of day four. <laughs>